reduce violent crimes in the city of Milwaukee is once again a hot topic at City Hall. The district attorney explained what his office is doing to reduce crime. Pete Zervakis joins us live from City Hall with the latest for us now. Pete. Bridget District Attorney John Chisholm told a special meeting today that went uh, for about three hours and just wrapped up here within the last 15 minutes or so that his office is working hard to crack down on violent crimes like carjackings and murders here in Milwaukee. He says prosecutors are working collaboratively with police to identify repeat criminals and keep them off the streets. But one committee member says he thinks judges are handing down soft sentences to repeat offenders that allow them to re-enter the community. He thinks Chisholm and the DA's office need to push for longer and harsher sentences. You don't take the phone calls about the multiple offenders. How many chances do we give these people? I prosecute cases aggressively when we can uh, have sufficient amount of evidence to prove those cases. And that's what we do. And then we make recommendations. Homicides in Milwaukee spiked by about 70% last year. Chisholm testified that his office has been securing convictions in roughly 90% of the homicide cases it tries going back to 1992. He says the DA's office has also brought charges in about 70% of non-fatal shooting incidents here in the city in recent years. He says bringing charges in those cases often depends heavily on cooperation from victims and witnesses. Live outside City Hall, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4. All right, Pete, thanks for the update. Police